Hello everyone, Phil Pravda here. Welcome back to another video here on the YouTube channel. And uh, this is going to be a redo of a video that I've done a few times in the past. And uh, as you can see right here on my screen on the laptop, that is the original video that I did for the how to fold your suit jacket for your luggage without any wrinkles when you get to your destination. This video has uh, 1.3, almost 1.4 million views on it. And I did it quite a while ago, and I've done a few updates since then, but I've looked at all of those, and I want to do another one with a better color jacket so you can really see the details, maybe some close-up on how I'm doing the fold. Some people still get confused when I turn the shoulder inside out and I twist the collar around. You'll see it in a moment when I do it for real right here. And uh, that's what this video is going to be about. You're going to make it short and sweet. You're going to make sure you can follow all the uh, directions on how to do this video. And if you look at any of the comments on the past videos, uh, the original one or the updates in subsequent years, you will notice that people have taken trips for long, long, long haul trips on air airplanes, in cars, on boats. And they said, I folded my suit. I folded my sport coat. I put it in the luggage flat. I didn't use any tissue paper, no plastic. And guess what? When I got there 20 hours later, I opened up my jacket. I put my jacket on or my suit on and I wore it right away at my destination. Or when I got there, I just hung it up in the closet and I wore it the next morning and I had no wrinkles. So that's the goal behind this. It's a fold that was taught to me by my father and it was taught to him by his father. So it's going back three generations now of this fold and I want to teach it to you right now. So I'm going to stand up and show you the ins and outs of how to fold your jacket for your luggage without any wrinkles when you get to your destination. Here we go. Hello everyone and uh, welcome back. And just uh, for an aside here, I just want to mention to you that uh, the suit that I have on right now, you could find at suitcafe.com. This is going to be uh, the upcoming new Kajlana in the charcoal gray. It's a beautiful 98% uh, wool, 2% lycra, natural uh, stretchiness, a little bit of give when you move around and in the pants. It's a nice uh, slim fit, flat front trouser, and it's all made in Italy, so what could be bad? So here we go, here we have a jacket, and this time I chose a plaid pattern because sometimes people can't see exactly what I'm doing with a jacket in a dark color. So when they can't see the fold, it's much more difficult for them to realize what I'm doing and to see the different uh, types of positions I'm putting the jacket in. So let's get, uh, let's get started here. We have a, just a regular uh, suit jacket, but it could be just a sport jacket if you want, or it could be a coat, or it could be um, like a blazer jacket, something soft construction that you wear casually. Uh, all those types of things you could fold exactly this way, and it could be for a man or for a woman. It doesn't just have to be a men's jacket. So the first thing you do is you take the jacket and you take your hands, palms uh, open like this, and you put them in the shoulders. So you can see here, I put one hand on this side, one hand on this side in the shoulder, just like that, and put your palms together on both sides. So you can see it right there. And then with your right hand, grab the left side of the shoulder like this, and then take your left hand out. So now I'm holding both shoulders. I'm hoping you can see exactly how that is. My hand is inside here. I'll show you a little more clearly. And I'm holding both shoulders right there. So this is actually, I'm good, I'm doing this update video because I never really did it this in depth. I sort of did it a little quickly and maybe some people couldn't get it. So a lot of people didn't get it and they said, wow, I did it. But uh, now hopefully you could really see what I'm doing. So I'm holding both shoulders from inside. I'll put that right back there. And then what I want you to do is raise the lapel and the collar. So raise both. So here's the Here's the collar with the felt underneath and the lapel has the little notch cut out here. It doesn't matter if you have a notch lapel or a peak lapel, whichever one you have will work with this fold. And uh, all you have to do now is uh, raise that up and now hold on to the middle, right in the middle, the top part of the collar, right here. Hold on to the top part of the collar. And this is the tricky part. I'm still holding the shoulders on the inside. Now I'm holding with my left hand the top part of the collar. And now I'm going to want you to twist. So I'm going to do it really slowly and I'm not going to let go so I can go back and do it again. But take this top part of the collar and you're going to twist to the left and then the inside shoulders you're holding, you're going to pull out to the right. So you're going to do something just like this. You see, I'm still holding it and I pulled it and now the jacket is sort of inside out with the shoulders inside out. You see that? I'm going to 
put it back the other way so you can see I didn't let it go yet. Okay, now I'm back the other way. Let me just raise the collar up again from where I started. Okay, now there's where I started. I still didn't let go of those shoulders. I'm going to do it one more time, and now I'm going to let go of the shoulders, but I'm going to hold on to the collar. So here we go. We're just going to twist. We're going to go like this and pull those shoulders out, and now I'm going to let go of the shoulders with my right hand. See? Now I let go, and I'm going to take my two hands here. I'm going to line up the lapel. So now I'm going to take those two notch, the cutout here in the lapel itself, and I'm going to line it up. So you see right there? I think it's good that I'm wearing a dark background because you could see the contrast of the light jacket on my dark suit and you can really see what's going on. Okay, so tricky part one is done. Hopefully you all got it. The lapel is lined up. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to hold the jacket with the lapels together with our left hand and with our right hand we're going to push through these two shoulder blades we're going to push them through to the other side. So you see how here there's like a hole? This is where the sleeve is. And now the two shoulder pads are on this side, as you can see right here. And this goes whole, and this has the shoulder pads on this side here. We're going to push this through to the other side. And what that's going to do is, effectively, it's going to fold the jacket in half horizontally. Ready? So here we go. We're going to push through right here, and we're going to push those shoulder pads through. And we're going to keep our right hand in there. We're not holding anything, we're just keeping it in there. And now you can see the jacket is resting, both shoulder pads. Now it looks like a shoulder, right? Now you see it looks like a shoulder. The sleeve is inside. Both shoulder pads are nice and even. The lapel is still nice and even right here. And the jacket is folded effectively sort of in half right here, vertically. I meant to say vertical. Uh, vertically, right here. Now all we have to do is one last step. We're holding the jacket like this. I'm looking at myself in the screen here to make sure you could see everything. So we're holding the jacket like this. Effectively, it's resting on our right hand. And all we want to do is now let the jacket easily fold over our arm on the left side. So we're going to just take it like this. And I'm going to just drop it over just like that. And we can take both hands, fold it. And now we can lift it up. And look what we did. We folded a jacket completely flat. The collar is flat. The shoulder pads, which is the most important part, are in the correct position, and the shoulder pads are also flat. So you're not wrinkling or bending your shoulder pads when it's flat in the luggage like this. Your jacket is completely flat right now. You can put it in your luggage. You can fold your trousers, which I have a video on how to fold trousers. You can watch that also. I'll link it right here. You can put your trousers right on top or right underneath. Put your jacket in the luggage. Put other things on top if you want. Put two suits on top or three suits on top if you want, and when you take it out of your luggage, there won't be any wrinkles. So now I'm going to show you how easy it is just to open this up and wear it if you wanted to. All you have to do is you take it out of the luggage like this, and nothing special. Just find the collar, let it drop open, open it up, put your hands back in like when you started, and there you go. Your jacket is just like it was at the beginning. See? And there's nothing wrong with it. Of course, we didn't travel anywhere now, but this is how it will come out when you get to your destination. So now I'm going to do it one more time, and I'm just going to do it quickly like I normally usually do it, and see if you could follow along um, it, from the way I started with the individual steps, and then try it on your own, and practice it, of course, time after time, and you'll become a real pro at uh, doing this fold. So here we go. I'm not going to uh, discuss what I'm doing. I'm just going to do it, and you'll see right here. How quickly it can be done. Line up the lapel, push it through, fold it over, and there it is, flat for your luggage, just like that. So this has worked for three generations of my family. Uh, obviously, we've traveled over, over all those years, business trips to uh, Europe for uh, menswear, for men's clothing. Uh, still doing it, suits from Italy, ties from Italy. And uh, coming up on the website, we have beautiful, beautiful new silk pocket squares and silk handkerchiefs and beautiful alpaca scarves for the winter that are going to be going up. And just before we end this video, I'll do it one more time, just quickly for you. Boom. Boom. Line it up, push it through, fold it over, and there you go. Flat for your luggage each time. So I hope you got that. Practice it. Of course, leave me a comment and tell me how you did the first time and how you did after you practiced it a few times, if it got easier for you. And of course, if you go on a trip and you use this fold, I'd like to hear about how the jacket came out 
when you return from your trip. And of course, hit that like button, YouTube likes, thumbs up, and subscribe because I have a lot of interesting videos about how to fold things, how to fold clothing, and of course, all the new clothing that comes in for Suit Cafe. You could see it on the YouTube channel, unboxing videos of new merchandise, unboxing videos of custom-made shoes. We have custom-made jeans, a lot of nice things that we don't always have on the website, but that are offered. So thanks again for watching. I hope you were able to see this fold and I hope you're able to use it with great success. And I'll see you all again when I'm back at it.